What's up? I'm Rob. You're watching Man vs. Pin, the show where you pin them and I win them. Sometimes. Sometimes. This week's suggestion comes in from Leilani Allen, who's been all over the comments the past couple weeks with this pin, where you make drinking glasses using your old beer bottles. A pretty cool pin. It got liked up a bunch, so I'm gonna give it a go. Alcohol? Fire? DIY? What can possibly go wrong? Materials. Beer bottles with painted on graphics. Cotton string or yarn. Some sandpaper, if you get that far a lighter and some lighter fluid, nail polish remover, a bowl of ice, and a couple little sauce dishes or cups, and f*** it, let's get safe and use some gloves and get a fire extinguisher up in here. First, I'm emptying all the beer into the sink. <laughs> uh, just kidding. That's the stupidest thing you could do. I'm emptying them all into my stomach, of course. There's no better time to play with highly flammable liquids and glass than when you're buzzing, am I right? Now this pin tells me to tie a piece of string tightly around the bottle where I want the top of the glass to be. Then remove it, soak it in some lighter fluid for a minute or two, then slip it back onto the bottle, making sure the string is running straight across the top of the bottle. Alright, now I've got my bowl of ice water ready, and it's time to light this bitch up. Alright, we've got ourselves some pyrotechnics. Alright, I'm spinning the glass around to make sure all sides are getting the same amount of heat. It says to wait about 10 to 15 seconds until the flame goes out, then pour the ice water on top. And what's supposed to happen is the extreme opposite temperature of the water is going to crack the top off somewhat perfectly and evenly along my string line. Uh-huh, I heard the crack. It just didn't fall off like it was supposed to, so I tapped it a couple times and... Huh. Wow. What a... what a beaut, huh? Real nice finish there. That crack there, that's a nice little detail. In all seriousness, I guess... Well, I guess we gotta empty another beer bottle. Damn. Oh yeah, that's the stuff. Here we go. Woo! Now for this one, I'm trying something a little bit different because I read another pin that said to use nail polish remover instead of lighter fluid. This time around, I just repeated the same steps all over again, lit her up, and... and absolutely nothing happened. All right, one more time here. Here we go. Here we go. Nothing. Okay. All right. Back to the lighter fluid, I guess. Again, I did the whole to-do, added some extra lighter fluid for good measure, and lit that sucker up. Oh wow, that's nice. Huh? Look at that. Spin it around there. Quick question, what's the coolest thing you've ever watched burn, or set on fire yourself? Leave it in the comments below. That should prove to be some interesting reading. Alright, fire's going out, pour the ice water on top of it. Yeah, yeah, there's that crack, and... Boom. That worked. Oh, well, what the f***? Come on, now. I'll tell you what, good thing I got three of these. All right, let's burn some shit. Empty bottle. String wrapped tight as f around the bottle. Douse this f***ing thing in lighter fluid. Set it into some flames. Watch it burn. Ice water. crackety doo da. Oh, get the f*** out of town. This project sucks. So yeah, these look awesome. These are these turned out really, really cool. Just really something. I can't wait to bring these out the next dinner party. These are gonna be the talk of the talk of the town. Cheers. And hey, remember, if you have any pins that you want me to test out right here on the show, leave them in the comments below and I'll check them out. Until next time. You no longer have to purchase glasses. You just use the ones you already got. It's crazy. It's so easy, too, you know? So easy. You don't even need to sand the edges off of them. It's crazy. Am I bleeding?